Hello, I hope everyone's doing well today. According to Statista.com, there are currently 3.6 billion social media posters in the world today. And I want to talk to you about how these posts, pre and post accident, could greatly affect your personal injury claim. And you might be thinking, but how can something I post on social media affect my personal injury claim? And if so, I think that's a great question. And really it all comes down to your recovery, your settlement. Damages are an element of your claim and the damages element is further broken down into what's called past pain and suffering, future pain and suffering, past mental anguish and future mental anguish. And adjusters and defense attorneys will go out to people's social media postings to try to disprove each of these elements. You want to make sure and beware of that pink panther. And by that I mean adjusters and defense attorneys both either investigate themselves or hire investigators to go out and search the social media accounts of injured victims. So you want to make sure you have all of your settings set to the highest level of privacy. Beware of adding any friends after you've been involved in the accident, especially if you don't know them. And also adjusters can go through and if they're able to access your account or they happen to know someone that knows you, which in a small town that's highly likely, and look at your posts that way. So you just wanna be careful in posting after an accident, especially because there's a chance that there's someone out there trying to get information to hurt you and to decrease the value of your claim. As always, your best route is to follow the advice of your personal injury attorney following an accident um, with anything related to your case, but especially to posting on social media. But the safest route is stop, don't do it, don't post, don't give the adjusters and defense attorneys ammunition to decrease the value of your claim. Stay safe.